One thing the pandemic has taught us is the importance of having a medical provider, but some people are still a little nervous about going to the doctor's office. Experts say you shouldn't only rely on urgent care centers. THV 11's Jordan Howlington tells us how you should go about finding a new primary care physician in the age of coronavirus. This is a time that really lets us know the importance of having a health care team, having a home, somebody that you trust and can call on when you have these questions because there has been so much information out there. Dr. Nia Shaw has a few tips if you're looking for a new doctor during the pandemic. Start looking online or talking to friends or family of who they use as far as knowing who to trust. And online profiles for health care providers are a good place to start. That you can try to get to know somebody. A lot of folks will want to pick somebody that's also from a small town or maybe they went to the same college together or a female versus a male provider. And so you can pick that way. Scheduling a visit could take some time if you're a new patient, but Dr. Shaw says that shouldn't stop you. You know, it might take three or four weeks to get in with a new primary care provider. And if there's nothing urgent going on to maybe let that time subside, go on and make the appointment so that then when you do have something more urgent, they're your person, they're your doctor, they're your primary care provider that you can call on in the future. Many are turning to telehealth during the pandemic, but if it's been a while since you've had a physical, a specific exam, or you just feel more comfortable coming in, you should go in person. You know, coming in for your preventive care, getting vaccinations, getting pap smears, mammograms, chemicals, prostate exams, um, your labs checked, your blood pressure checked, is all very important um, to not delay on, we wanna catch things early, the earlier that we catch things, um, the decreased morbidity and mortality, typically speaking. Jordan Howington, THV 11 News.